Hey guys, welcome to another video and today I'm going to show you how to convert this simple sketch to a vector format where you can change the colors, include that into a print ready file and just play around and do whatever you like in a vector format. So as you can see here, I have this not particularly high quality photo of my sketch. I just took a photo from my iPhone and uh, I sent it to my computer. We want to make this as high contrast as possible. So we want to have only a black and white photo uh, with basically only either white or black color and nothing in between so that uh, it can be converted into vector easily. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go the, to the adjustment layers. I'm going to turn this into a black and white image. And on top of that, I'm going to include one level adjustment layer and curves adjustment layer. Now, with curves, what you want to do is you want to make the grays darker from a certain threshold and the paper you want to make completely white. So we are just going to play around with, with this uh, in, in this way. You can see that it's starting to approach what we want to have. And if I go all the way down here with this and make this kind of a step, it's not really a curve, it's actually looks like a just a step. Um, you can see that we've completely separated the black and the white. So now we have black for the icon and white for the image and we have nothing in between. Basically maybe a couple shades of gray but there is no spectrum, it's just black and white. And that's exactly what we need. And I'm going to export this part of the image only with the um, with the book to Adobe Illustrator. And here we go. Now we have this black and white image in Adobe Illustrator and we're going to run image trace on this in order to convert this into vector. So you should see this option image trace here on your top bar, but if you don't see it, I think you you will be definitely able to find it in the properties window. I hope. Yes, it's here. And um, we, we would like to go for the sketched art option, which when clicked will convert this into a vector. And here we go. Now I'm going to click expand here. And what you can see here is that we have this completely in vector. It can be scaled up and down without any um, deterioration in quality and just has all the advantages that the vector has. So as you can see, I can change the color to red, for example. Oops, we have to switch this to RGB mode. Yes. So now you can switch it, switch the color, you can do whatever you want with it. And um, you can see it was very, very easy and very quick. So that's it. That's how you convert a hand sketch into a vector in under five minutes. It's super easy, can be used for print, um, web, whatever, uh, really brings life to your designs. So thanks for watching. If you found this useful, consider liking and subscribing this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.